welcome Jennifer Fields, everybody. women in the audience. I think that was very well done of you. Well, you know what? I think what happens, I think when the women know that there's someone from the L word is on. No, I think it's for you. No, I think it's for you. No, I think... be, uh, because I'm a little shy. Are you shy? When it comes to talk shows and things, and I really, really didn't want to do any more talk shows, but my publicist sent me some tapes of you, and then I developed a small crush. Oh. And so I thought... I say. <laughs> How and I see many other women have as well. I, I find this, I find this fascinating. So, so the the lesbian thing is all a big act, then. Yes, yeah. yes, right. that's acting. Uh, it's like Noah Wiley's not a doctor. No, right. Hannibal uh, Lecter, uh, who is a cannibal, but Anthony Hopkins is, is not, not a cannibal. That's right. right. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Right. Did, you, did you even think about that before you took the part as? Uh, Playing a, a gay woman, did you think? Oh, no, I, don't... I didn't really think about it. I just, uh, I thought it's a really great part. And when I was researching the role, I mostly focused on the fact that she's a museum director and had to do that research. And then when it came time to do a love scene, I was like, oh my god, I'm playing a lesbian. I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing something special, I guess. I don't know. See, now, I, when I worked as an actor, I always thought, you know, when you do have a love scene with someone, you know, and you always pretend that ah, it's very technical. There's a lot, you know, when people say on talk shows, right. it's very but it's not. You, yeah. you make out with someone. No, you you'd make out with someone. <laughs> <laughs> That's your technique. Really? Which, you know, with, with the dancing that you did, I saw that. Oh, that did you like really my? Uh, did you like the dance? Yeah. 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 I think. <laughs> I uh. <laughs> I yeah. I don't think you need to see it. See, actually, you know, when you look at that, look at that picture of me again. Look at that. Oh. Remember. Uh, do you remember Brian May from Queen? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> a bit like Brian May from Queen, I think. Something queeny about it, anyway, that's for sure. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm getting mercy votes from women now because of the, uh, my flash dance thing. Do you get tired of the flash dance? Uh, no, reference? not really. I mean, there's different people bring up different films, and I think that film meant a lot to a lot of people, yeah. so it's fine. See when I pulled the water down and it splashed on me? Yeah, it's It was nice. freezing. <laughs> Is that what it was like when Welcome you did it? Welcome to the club. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Now, so you, you, took the, you took the L word show, you took the... Uh, does L stand for love in this or does it stand for well, lesbian? it stands for many things. All right. But lesbian is definitely one of them. Right. But yes, when I took the show, love, I didn't lesbian, really... Love, lesbian, what else? Didn't... Uh, laxative. Laxative, all right. <laughs> yeah, which you can get in Starbucks. <laughs> yeah. I so, so the L word stands for love between right. women. Yes. Right. Okay. Exactly. Right. Okay. Yes. Now, where do you make it? Do you do you shoot it here in LA? No, we shoot in Vancouver. Oh, Vancouver, Canada. Yeah. How do they How do they feel about all these women making out all over? Well, I'm I'm sure they're very happy to be employed. What? So you have Canadians on your show? Yes. Oh, good for you. Yeah. That's good to have Canadians working. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> no, I like that. I've, no, I've been to Vancouver. I, I like it very much indeed. Do you like it up there? Yeah, I'm just looking at you. You're so cute. I can't even listen. Oh, to you. stop. <laughs> okay, I'll try to focus now. Right, yeah. Do, yeah. I like Vancouver? Do you want yeah. to see the flash, flash yeah. dance thing again? <laughs> That'll temper it for you. Yes, I like. We'll get back. I'll, I'll focus now. All yes, right, focus. I like yeah. Vancouver. I spend a lot of fun times in Vancouver. You don't even. <laughs> you know, you don't seem shy to me at all. I, uh, you, you are very shy. You yes. shy? Well, why? Do, I've heard the actors talk about this before. Why would you take a job like an actor if you're shy? When people are going to look at you all the time. Well, you get to pretend that you're someone else, and then you pretend that you're someone who's not shy, and then it works out. Why don't you just pretend you're someone who's not shy and work in a bank? I don't know. Yeah. Well, because you'd only get to be the bank teller. Whereas right. then I get to play lots of people. You could, but no one... I could one change would... jobs all the time, you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you could pretend, every day you go to work, you could pretend to be something else. Like one day you could pretend to be a lesbian, and then <laughs> you could be a lesbian bank teller. Then but you see, could the be... problem is, is then you, 
it's very hard to work out any aggression. Like my character Bet on the L word is quite aggressive and she gets angry very easily and yeah, right. and you can't really do that so much in real life because you'll get hurt or someone will start screaming back at you. Yeah. So. I always like that about acting that you could win arguments. I know, I uh, love yeah, it. Exactly. <laughs> and that's that and you walk out and people go, hmm, because in real life that doesn't happen, no. you know. Yeah. They follow you and go, wait a minute, and you go, oh, no, no, I was done, I said my thing. In fact, all this season, it's just a horrible season for my character. I lose every fight, it's just horrible. I, I suffer terribly until later on the, in the show when there's one episode where I win one argument. And I read the script and I was so happy, I just started crying. I was like, something good happens to Beth, something good happens to Beth. Do you think, do you think that, uh, Do you think that women in same-sex relationships argue more than men and women? Or they argue about different things? I mean, did you research this? No. You didn't research other lesbians? Not other lesbians, I mean lesbians. You didn't, <laughs> you didn't research it? You didn't go talking to any lesbians? No, because I, f I felt that really the relationship was about love. And, right, it's about know, a relationship. You love somebody and... I mean, it's true in the scenes we do fight a little bit differently. It's lower. The blows are much lower. Mm. Oh, lower, lower, yeah. Like dirty, dirty fighting. Me. Women don't fight dirty. Yes, they do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah now, I'll do. talk to you more about that. We've got to take a break. We'll be right back with Jennifer Bale. Oh, yeah. Welcome back, everyone. I'm here with Jennifer Bale, star of The L Word on Showtime. And um, what about... I have, I read this, I don't know if it's true, that you, you've been over to uh, Scotland, is that right? Have you been there to the old country where I'm from? I've been to Scotland a long time ago. Did you have a nice time? Were they nice to you? Yes, they were very nice to me. I went with my boyfriend and, um... Uh, uh, <laughs> no, a lot, lots my, of people my... go to Scotland with their boyfriends. It's all right. <laughs> and the thing that I remember most is that uh, we had a romantic interlude in a field. Let me just... Let me just stop you, a romantic interlude. Yes. Right, so you, uh, yes. completely? Yes, a complete wow. romantic interlude in a field. That's, that's illegal in Scotland. <laughs> Even if you're married. <laughs> so, what, so you had so, a romantic yes, interlude in the field. we had a field. romantic interlude in the field, and I remember um, having a post-romantic interlude sleep in nice. the field. And I remember waking up to um, these big pair of Wellington boots, you know, those big yes. rain boots sort of things. Was your boyfriend wearing them? No. Oh. It was the farmer whose field it was. Ah. ah. And he started screaming at us in a language that I knew was English, but I couldn't understand. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, you were in Scotland though, right? Yeah. Uh, now, was, did you have your clothes on? I had um, had the common sense to put my clothes back on, but my boyfriend had not, so he was... Fallen asleep naked in a field? He was That's a hopeless a person. Yeah. <laughs> you, you're an adventure. You know, I'm going to refer you something, to something you said earlier to me, that you're a very shy person. Well, um, like, you know, I wouldn't have a romantic interlude in a field with, you know, a crowd. <laughs> Were, the, were there any sheep in the field? No. All right. In Scotland, there's a lot of sheep, you know. And, uh, I know. and they look at you with that judgmental eye. <laughs> what are you doing? No, I think it was an agricultural crop. It was an agricultural perhaps. crop that was growing. <laughs> Boy, I so wish I'd had some of those carrots. Uh, no, no, I don't. Think taller. Ta know. Taller. What was it? Oh, it was tall. Know. Wheat. Perhaps. I don't know if they grow wheat in Scotland. We'll say they do. <laughs> banana trees. It's probably banana trees. Lots of banana trees in Scotland. So what do you do now when you're, when you're not working in Vancouver? How do you relax? How do you take time out? I sleep a lot. Nice. And, um, Fields or at home? No, at home. <laughs> at home. And I've been taking a Sanskrit class. Sanskrit? I know. You're going to make a joke about it. I'm not going to make a joke about it. I'm fascinated. Why would you want to learn Sanskrit? Uh, well, when I... Um, it's an Indian language, right? Yes, it's an right. ancient... Ancient. ancient Indian language. When you go to yoga class, sometimes you chant different mantras or things, right. and they're in Sanskrit, so I thought I, maybe it's a good idea that I know what I'm saying. <laughs> so. well, and what are you saying? Things like, oh, I'm stretching, <laughs> oh, oh, this really hurts. Like, is that what it is? <laughs> What, what did he say? I mean, I, I have heard the namaste, all that, right, but right. What, uh, what does that mean? Namaste means that I, I salute uh, the God within you, or I salute, you know, it, in a way it's the I-thou relationship. The I-thou. We are both right. the same. 
Well, that's and rather we're nice. And we're both gods. <laughs> I know my teacher is going to kill me on Thursday. Right, so because that's, that's not true. That's not true. Right, okay. Yeah. What else have you learned in Sanskrit? I've learned to say the vowels. Oh, really? Can you say, can you say words like fart in Sanskrit? <laughs> no. <laughs> that's the words Nor I first go to. When I learn a language, I go straight to fart. <laughs> I, I've learned uh, the letters, how to say the letters, and, and because it's the philosophy of Sanskrit as a class, you sort of uh, learning the linguistic cosmogony. Of, you know, linguistic cosmogony is something that I rush toward whenever <laughs> I get a chance. You're an enchanting woman. Good luck with the L word. Thank you for coming in. Jennifer Beals, everybody. L word season premiere this Sunday on Showtime. We'll be right back with David Crumholt. Well, well, welcome, welcome back, my naughty little donkeys. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> all right, all right. My first guest tonight is a very charming and talented actress. She's on uh, that show, The L Word. Uh, in Showtime, uh, and she's in the new thriller, The Grudge 2, which is in theatres now. Take a look at this. <laughs> you can't cut it out there! Blinky playing it! <laughs> Please welcome Jennifer Beals, everybody. <laughs> Jen, are you all right? Are you all right? I know you're very nervous about talk shows. I always... I uh, yeah, are you okay, though? I'm, I'm okay. You look I'm sensational. Trying. I love your purple frock. Thank you. Very nice. You. And, and the movie looks very, very frightening. It's very creepy. Is it very creepy? Do you, do you like horror movies? Is that why you did it? I, I love horror movies, um, but I recently had a baby, so my sleep is at a premium, so I don't really watch them very much anymore. Yeah. But I thought the best way to um, really uh, be part of a horror movie and take part in all the great things that a horror movie has to offer is to be in it. Yeah, so yeah. I could perpetrate the horror. So rather. and get over the fear. That's what yeah, I always think. Is, that's why I want to be in a zombie film because I'm very frightened of zombies. <laughs> it's why we, uh, our, build, our studio is so high up. Uh, <laughs> so that zombies can't come and come in the win window. Yeah, I know it's kind of lame. But... <laughs> Did you, did you have a nice time making this film? Do you, I mean, because I think it'd be great fun making a horror picture. I had a great time. Yeah. Doing all that scary looks at everybody and the all that. The big eyes. Because yeah, yeah. it's part of the Japanese tradition. They yeah, yeah. have the big, like, kabuki eyes. Big kabuki eyes, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They don't know what kabuki is, and, <laughs> and neither do I. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Hey, uh, wait, you're still doing the L word as well. Are you up in Vancouver? Yes. I'm I like Vancouver. I love Vancouver. I was in Vancouver when I got this job. I was I heard, there. I heard you had made a little road trip. I did. Have you ever driven the road trip Vancouver oh, to L.A.? Yes, yes. You have? Oh, I did. The, well, I've driven Vancouver to L.A., but I had a very memorable um, trip from L.A. to Vancouver when my daughter was five weeks old. We took a road trip from L.A. to Vancouver so I could get to work. We have two big dogs You took a, a five-week-old baby and two dogs on okay, a road trip? Okay, I, I... Why none of my friends performed an intervention? I have uh, no idea. Yeah, really? I hold that against them. How long did it take? Like four weeks? An eternity. Yeah. <laughs> an eternity. Because you'd have to stop all the time. Yeah, you stop all the time, and then you feed for like an hour, and the dogs then have to go out, and... Oh, the, oh, the you're feed, wrangling yeah. wrangling the dogs... Can't you drive and, and feed at the same time? <laughs> Hey, it's called the Britney Spears. You just... Oh. What? It's all right. <laughs> it's all right. You can get special attachments. <laughs> no, that's, that's not nice. Well, couldn't your, couldn't your husband drive up then? Well, yeah, I, but I'm in the back with the baby. Well, you can feed on the move. Have you... Well, but see, I wasn't that experienced yet. Now I could feed on Oh, move. yeah. But at I... that time, I had no idea. Oh, yeah, because it's difficult. No one... I, I remember that when my son was born, his mother was kind of like, what? That way out does this work? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's a kind of... A, so what age is... Uh, is it a son, daughter, you have? The daughter. She daughter? just turned a year. Oh, well, congratulations. That's lovely. Yeah. That's nice. And, I, and, and so you go up to, are you staying up in Vancouver all the time? I like Vancouver, you see, that's why I'm...
Bush and I. So I think it's a lovely town. It's really beautiful. We're up there it's for Canadian, about... It's you know. It's Canada. I've heard. Yeah. I've heard too. Yeah. They speak English. I know. That's crazy. <laughs> they walk around with their bacon and their maple syrup. They're delightful. <laughs> hockey games. There is hockey. Do you like the hockey? Yeah, I love hockey. Really? Yeah. Well, it's fun. Uh, I like the sound of it. I like the excitement. I like playoff hockey. It's the best. What, 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 why? Because it's faster and there's more I violence? Just like, I just like the, the cold of the ice and the sound. You of actually the go to the game. You don't watch it on TV while you're, you know, feeding. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> actually, you know, you're joking, but my daughter I'm loves not joking. to watch hockey. Your daughter watches yeah, hockey at one years it. old? Yes. Earlier, when she was like two months old, she loved yeah. hockey. Maybe you know, it was the black and white Field. Maybe it's the noise as no, well. No, but some, I don't know. We didn't always have the noise up that high. But you, do you, what about Teletubbies until she can break her in a little bit? <laughs> Start with the Teletubbies. Maybe, you know, SpongeBob SquarePants. <laughs> then you can go to the full on brutal violence of men with sticks. <laughs> Such a suggestion. Hey. I'm just saying. Maybe after the baby Einstein. After the baby Einstein. Oh, I like the baby Einsteins. Have yeah, you got they're the, fun. Ah, they're good. Yeah, I still watch them. I like my own. the signing ones. <laughs> yeah. What's that? I like the ones where they sign. They sign. Yeah. yeah can Marley you sign? Can, can you sign? Are you a good signer? A little bit. Yeah, I can do a little bit too. Yeah. But I've, I think I've forgotten most of it. Well, I'm know. not. Good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I like you. Yeah. We have to take a break. We'll be right back with Jennifer Beals, everybody. Good night, sweetie. Tina, it was a really, it was a really nice night. It felt really good to be together and <laughs> getting along. She really she loved the sleigh ride. <laughs> so did I. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. I'm here with Jennifer Beals. That, that was a clip from The L Word, which is the, you know, the big feel-good lesbian comedy, isn't it? It's, uh... <laughs> It's just about human relationships, isn't it? It's just yes. it happens to be girls making out as well. That's right. It's, it's, kind of, <laughs> yeah. it's like if on Sex in the City, the women had actually slept with each other. Right. Which would be, I think, really entertaining. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> More entertaining than all that talk about shoes anyway, I tell you that. <laughs> That's how you get men to watch Sex in the City and the girls make out with each other. I'm there! <laughs> It's fantastic. Now, didn't you? I, haven't you been making another movie as well? The, the, or was it The Grudge too? The, the the horror movie. You go. Do you made it in Japan? Or? Yeah, yeah. We went to Tokyo. And really? Baby came with us. Do you take the whole family there? Yes. Did my you mom drive? Came with me. No, we didn't drive. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe rode over. I don't know. We'll just roll. The baby's almost six weeks old. <laughs> be fine. What could go wrong? We'll just get her a little life vest. Yeah, yeah, it'll be it'll fine. Be no, fine. so you took the baby. What age was the baby when you went over uh, to Japan? Let's see. She was five, five months. Well, that's nice. That's yeah. all right. I don't know anything about Japan. Did, have you, had you been there before? I had been there before, and, and my mother came with us, and my mother speaks Japanese, so. Really? How does that happen? Is your mother Japanese? No, my mother's not Japanese, but she went to go take a Spanish class. The Spanish class was full. Uh -huh. The only room left was in the Japanese class, so that's she started great. taking Japanese. But do you speak any Japanese? Um, I, I did learn to um, sing Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star in Japanese. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, and, and how does it go? Because I forget. Kira, kira, hikaru, yozora no hoshi yo. Mabataki shitewa, mitewa, or oh, stop it. No, 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 no. It's, it's a lullaby. It's a lullaby. It's a lullaby. I'm sorry. Oh, I was getting nervous. It's fantastic. It's fantastic. Do you know what's interesting, though? It sounds a bit like, uh, like Gaelic. Oh, well, maybe yeah. it's just my accent. No, no, no. I, I, I think what it is that the, in some way the Japanese and the Gales were separated by some meteor hit on Earth, and then, uh, and then zombies were involved. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe that could be the Grudge Threes. <laughs> you really were. You're right, It's lovely to see you again.
Yeah. Jennifer Beals, everybody. We'll be right back.
Jennifer Beals, everybody. Jennifer. I have to say, Jennifer, lovely as it is to see you, and it is, and you do look absolutely charming and gorgeous and sexy, and I like this metal thing going on here. <laughs> I'm surprised to see you uh, uh, hit somebody, because I think of you as being a rather kind of shy person. I am, I am a shy person, but I did grow up with brothers, so... I you see. know, I have acquired a few skills. Did, did you actually hit your brothers then? Is that what you're saying? Because CBS well, in no way endorses that kind of behavior. I did um, actually hit a... I don't even know if I should say this. Oh, you should. No one watches this show. You'll be fine. <laughs> nah. I did actually hit a boyfriend with a camera once. That's yeah. okay. <laughs> He was very badly behaved, I have to say, but it was on a, a, a train station in Morocco, which maybe was not the best. Wait, this is a great story. <laughs> so, first of all, you've got this boyfriend, and you uh, he's taking pictures of you. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> then what's the camera for? It's my camera to, oh, you know, document the trip and all. Oh, uh, in Morocco? Yes. Right, right and right. where were you in Morocco? Uh, Mar Marrakesh, Casablanca. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of French people up and down there. Oui, you know oui, that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you speak French? Uh, pas bien. No. Pas bien. No, right. Tu peux essayer, si tu veux. Oh, yeah, see, you got me right there. <laughs> There's a couple of people, a girl from the valley would probably help you out, though she speaks. <laughs> um, <laughs> do you know, if I had a nickel for every time I'd said that sentence, there's a girl from the valley. <laughs> Now, listen, tell me about the Chicago Code, then. Do you play a tough cop I'm who... I'm sorry, I'm very distracted by this. <laughs> this is fantastic. Do you know, you I was, you I was bitten anything. by a rattlesnake. Touch it again if you want. There you go. Oh, you know how to hold it. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I did. Okay. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, nice. just nice. cup underneath. There you are. <laughs> now, are you fond of snakes? I am, actually. I am fond of snakes. Really? I was bitten by a rattlesnake, though. Shut the hell up. I was. You were bitten? A snake? Yes, I was. Recently? Mm, a while ago, but on my foot. On my foot. And it was like being stabbed by two safety pins. Uh, are you all right? Yeah. What I'm, kind of a snake I'm, was it? I'm fine. It was, I don't know which kind of rattlesnake it was. It was a rattlesnake? Yes, it well, was a rattlesnake. why didn't you avoid it when you heard the rattling? Well, because it was a baby, and so the rattle's very quiet. Oh, so you were just kind of like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Did exactly. you get sick? Uh, I did, actually. Well, first I had the swelling, and I, I took some Arnica, which is this homeopathic medicine for the swelling, and that went away. Right. And then uh, my husband and I were driving in the car, and I felt myself outside of the car watching myself, and I was realizing that I wasn't breathing, and I didn't need to breathe. What? And it was very strange. Ooh, this so is I, acid you're talking I, yeah. about now. <laughs> And so I, I said, I think I need to go to the hospital. So we went to the hospital where they did nothing. It was amazing. How much did they charge you for that <laughs> yeah, nothing? Exactly. Wow. Yeah. So, and you, well, you, were, you had an out-of-body experience from a rattlesnake I bite? did. It was not unpleasant, I have to say. It was not unpleasant. <laughs>
Then snakes, so I'll put this out of the way. Then are you, okay. are you, are you frightened by snakes? No, or? no, not at all. No. What do you like snakes? Yeah, or? I do. I do like snakes. Do you have any snakes? I don't. I don't. But I, I do like them. Oh, really? I you do. like them, but not enough to have one. No, but I like to pet them, and actually, their tongues are very soft. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> In your pants. Hey! So tell me about the Chicago Cult then. You play it. Okay. Yo, you, do, do you make it in Chicago? That looked a bit yes. like Chicago yes. there. Yes, it's completely Are you from Chicago? Yes, I am. No way! Yes! I didn't know they had rattlesnakes in Chicago. No, I didn't get bitten in oh, Chicago. Right. No, right. Well, what kind of snakes do they have in Chicago? Oh, political. political. Oh. <laughs> what part of Chicago are you from? Well, I, I both the north side and the south side, so it's both Cubs and Sox. So you're kind of family. bi curious. Yes. And <laughs> Do you know? Have you ever met Oprah? I have actually. Really? Yeah. She's, what does she smell like? Um, quite lovely, like um, baby powdery. I suspected. Yeah, I suspected like not cologne, not kind of oh no, no like no, too no. much, like oh here comes Oprah. But uh, <laughs> I suspect some kind of like wealthy, classy kind of smell. Yeah. Like friendly, like a friendly smell. Really. Like kind of baked yes. cookies? No, like 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 um the sweetness of babies kind of the smell. The sweetness of babies? Yeah. I've got a ten day old baby in the house right now. <laughs> he doesn't smell that good at all. The you, top of the head, the top of the head. Oh, the top still, of the head yeah. smells the good, yeah. Bit, but, the but, but you know, you have to fight through a lot of different aromas <laughs> to get to the top of the head. Do you, uh, you've got, you've got a child, haven't you? Yes, I do. Your daughter? Yes. What I age do. is she? She's five. Five? Oh, he's, you're past all that now. Yeah, uh, no, yeah, she's now sleeping. But she didn't, you know, sleep a lot when she was... Well, they know? don't. They don't, yeah. they're not interested. And they're, there's no reasoning with them at all. No, I, no. Last night, I was saying to him, you know, this is getting us nowhere. He's like, <laughs> Like, this isn't a debate. This isn't even a, a, a discussion. <laughs> <laughs> I feel your pain. It's, but it's, but are you going to have more? Well, I, I would love to, but if God is willing to give a surprise, that would be nice. But well, you, you got to have sex. Well, yeah. You can't just hang around waiting. I mean, yeah. God, of course, will help you, but you have to well, participate. Trying, I mean, really. I'm trying to very gently say that I'm a little long in the tooth, maybe, to have another. No, no, yeah. What, are so? you like 31? You're fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm 31. Well, there you are. Yeah. Hey. Have you ever um, uh, posted uh, topless pictures of yourself on the internet? Always, every day. Really? Yeah. No, I would never do. Would you ever do? No, 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 no never in no. a million years. You, I can I... barely get out of the house. Much no. Less, you know. I, what I think is, that I just don't. Have you ever been on any of these Craigslist things or anything like that? I've never. No. no. It's you ever bought thing. anything from the internet? Uh, you know. Amazon, like a book or something. Right. Yeah. No, oh I've no, no! I did buy a few Buffy the Vampire Slayer like magnets. <laughs> I did. Why did you need them? I had a little crush on Spike, so I just wanted to have my own personal. I never watched the Buffy, the vampire slayer. Oh, it's really was good. Was it good? I, I'm, do you watch the new vampires? The you know the kind of twinky gay vampire. <laughs> well, once you you know have a child, it's not. Yeah, I know. No. But well, see, see, my you know I've got this certain rules about vampires. They can be gay or straight. I got no problem with that. But it's, it's more kind of a, I quite like them to suck blood. You know, I mean. It's, <laughs> Not just care about your feelings. I mean, that's, that's not a vampire. That's just a gay friend. You know, it's... Uh, you know, that's just me. I'm not getting enough sleep. I'm very cranky. I'm that's very, all right. Yeah. That's all right. We're out of time. Uh, awkward pause or mouth organ? Mouth organ. Good. <laughs>
do you play? Because you know, surprisingly, a, a, a very small amount of people actually play the mouth organ. And if you can play the mouth organ, you win the coveted gold mouth organ that we give no, away here. I, I, I don't know how to play a mouth organ, but I'm, I'm happy to try. Well, do you know how to play? No. Let's go. <laughs> Can you go then? Oh, I can do this too? Yeah, yeah, well, you yeah, didn't just... even unwrap it for me. What well, I'll unwrap it for you? you if you want. Yeah, thank yeah. you. <laughs> Sorry, I usually, uh, you know, I'm a bit nervous. All right. There you are, it's unwrapped okay, and uh, okay. never been touched. Hmm. Okay, can I ask a really silly question? Sure. Which side? <laughs> Feel your way. That's pretty good for a first timer. Thanks. All right, knock it off. Turn the middle, everybody. We're right back.